You've probably heard the name Rothschild. This is a name of a huge family and everything they have is huge, especially their money. This family started with Meyer Amschel Rothschild. He grows up in a lower class Frankfurt neighborhood. Meyer was unlucky and another unlucky thing happens to him. At the age of 12, his mom and dad die because of smallpox. After his parents died, he had no choice but to start making money on his own so he can at least not starve. He goes to the bank and gets a job. When Meyer went to the bank, he kind of fell in love with what they do. And that's where he kind of found a hobby to collect coins and read about all types of coins. He got very good at it. He knew what coins were valuable and what wasn't. And that is why with the money he made, he would buy these coins from other people. Coins that he knew he could make money off of. Around 13, 14, he was already making money. He kind of finds himself and he knows what he can do to make money. When he got his life together, he got married and had 10 children and five of them were son. This video is not about Meyer Amschel's Rothschild life, but it's about the Rothschild family. The man that started his job around the 1760 and he started the richest family in the entire world. When Mayer died, he was a very successful international banker. And that is why five of his son were working at different banks around Europe. There's a lot of writings about this family, but we really don't know which is correct and which one is lied. But the best source we found is that Mayer's son would give loans to government, especially when there was a war going on. And all this loaning out to the government for war made the Rothschild extra rich. There's a lot of different writings about this family. Like Discover Magazine, in 2013 said when Mayer was on his deathbed he told his children to not marry outside the family so this money does not leave our family they wouldn't even marry other Jewish people only family member and that's around like the cousins first cousins not even second cousins Another reason the Rothschild became a very wealthy family is because of one of his sons, Nathan Mayer Rothschild. He also had the business mind like his father. It's around the Industrial Revolution and money does a lot. All the industrial places in Europe needed money and the Rothschild Bank would provide the loan for these people and he made a lot of money off of them. Nathan was very smart in the business sense and he told his family we have to pack up and leave. They said where? He said we have to go to England because right now in the industrial revolution we can grow even more in England. And he took his company and family from Germany to England. When they got to England they started a bank called NM Rothschild and Sons. When he went to England his bank became international all over the world. And anywhere in the world where the English government would approve, the Rothschild would provide a loan to that government. And day by day, their wealth was growing. Like for example, they would provide loans to the Brazil government, even Japan. And the coolest part is that when they were building the Suez Canal, the biggest investor was Nathan. In around this era, they would tell Nathan he's the most powerful man in England. Nathan also had seven sons and they worked for his dad since the very early age. So now we know that Meyer started the family business and Nathan times that by a few. But after Nathan, 
None of them were as good as these two. They didn't really cause a revolution like these two, but their banking is still up. A lot of people say, anywhere in the world that there is money, the Rothschild have their hands on it. It's been nearly 300 years since the Rothschild empire started. They say right now their family is worth around $400 billion. But nobody actually knows the real number. They have so many people around the world that nobody can actually calculate it. Right now, Elon Musk, with a net worth of $240 billion, is the richest man in the world. But Elon Musk is one person, but the Rothschild are hundreds of people, and each of them have billions of dollars. Nobody can actually find the exact net worth and how much they actually have. But everybody knows that the Rothschild is the most powerful and richest family in the world. Just like any subject in the world, especially things about money and power, there are a lot of conspiracy theories. Around the Rothschild family, not only is there more than 10, but hundreds of conspiracy theories. Some people say that these guys control the world. They eliminate whoever they don't want, and they bring up whoever they want. Some people believe that the Jews run the world, and their owner are these guys. Some website write that the Rothschild net worth, if you add every asset they have up, it's gonna be more than $2 trillion. This is from the website Investopedia, and we don't know if we should believe it or not. There's another theory that says some of the Rothschild are fake, and for them to be more successful in the world, they may change their name, and those guys even add to the net worth of that family. Either way, we don't know how much money the Rothschilds have because nobody can investigate around this family. It might be because of the insane power they have and anyone that starts to investigate them, they shut them down somehow. And that is why we don't actually know the truth.